We're going to unbox the Surface Pro today. The original Surface Pro, uh, not the number two. This is the original Surface um, Pro with Windows 8 on it. This is the box. Look at that, shiny. It's a 64 gig version. And uh, these have an i5 built into them uh, with 4 gig of RAM. 1080p display, touch screen, obviously. Nice box and packaging. So let's get inside it and have a look. That, look at that, mm -hmm. shiny. Let's have a look inside. So, they always package these things up really well. It's nice. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh. Just turn that around. There we go. So yeah, here's the charger, and uh, it's like a MagSafe design, like on the 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 Apple devices. Um, nice connector, quite slim, and they have a little light on them as well, so you can see the charging. Uh, it's a 12 volt charger with a built in USB slot there so you can charge devices up as well, which is pretty cool. Like a, a secondary device, a phone or camera or whatever. And there's the plug as well, just a standard plug. Quite nice actually, not bad. The tablet, and you get like a stylus with it as well. Not? Just grab that out of there. So we'll just put the box aside. Not really fussed about the instructions. So this is the tablet. Really nice design. They're not very thick at all. If you look at them in comparison to <coughs> the Surface 2, uh, not the Pro, just the Surface 2. Uh, not far off at all. There's a bit more weight in the Pro because it's obviously a full 64-bit processor. So let's have a good look inside this thing. <laughs> Can't get into it. Okay, so this is what it looks like. They have a kickstand built in, like the Surface uh, 2 um, and Surface 2 Pro. A little kickstand, and they go into sort of two positions, I believe. No, maybe not. <laughs> Doesn't. Yeah, that, no? um, the Surface 1 only has one position. Ah, so Surface 2 has two kickstand positions. So you can click it there or there. Which is pretty cool. So that's good. Is this a Surface 2 Pro? Yeah. So this is a Surface 2 Pro here, and these two are Surface Pros number two. No. So <laughs> Surface 2, Surface Pro 2, Surface 2. That's the one. Yeah, I'll get there eventually. You can show the difference as well, can't you? Mm. You can show the kickstands. Mm. Mm. Yeah, so yeah, 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 yeah. Back. Oh, wait, hang on. That way around? Oh, wait, actually, if you look at it, fold it like that. Oh. Look, you've got the massive windows over there and you haven't got that on this one. Oh yeah, that's a nice feature, I like that. Yeah, it looks better with that. It does look better surface. with that, yeah. Yeah, I like that. And obviously there's your pen as well, so that'll stick on the side right yeah, here, is like, it? Yeah, just like, yeah. the same size. the charge port. Oh, I don't know, it's not... Mm. Oh, there, oh yeah, I see, yeah. Magnetically... Yeah, magnetic yeah, yeah. yeah. So what, what the th what's the thickness difference I'm there, I'm pretty then? sure they're looking more or less the same, aren't they? Yeah, they're identical. And that's the Surface Pro 2, right? Yeah, this is the Pro 2. This is just the Surface Pro original. So let's turn this thing on. A little look what it can do. It's got any charge in it at all? Mm -hmm. I don't think it's got any charge in it. Wow, that's, that's a first for a Microsoft device. Yeah, looks like it's flat. Okay, we'll charge that in a minute. Yeah, nice devices. Uh, you got like plenty of sound on them. They're pretty cool. Obviously, get a stylus with it. Um, you get USB three on the side here. So you can plug in devices, volume up and down, uh, headphone socket, front and rear. Facing cameras, I believe they're both 1080p on this, aren't they? Uh, I'm not sure. 1720. 1720, one's 1080. Pretty cool. Okay. Let's plug it in now and get charged. So we've turned it on, we've charged it up for a little bit. Um, it asks you for your language and location, so we've invented that. And it asks you for a computer name, like a unique computer name for your network and for various other reasons. So you can call it whatever you want. Uh, call it a uh, P surface. The touch screen on this thing is great, um, obviously we've got these anyway, but they're they're very good to type on, they're very accurate. P surface, that'll do, next. Uh, it asks us to connect to Wi-Fi, but we'll do that later because it's quite a long code for us. Uh, Customise the setup, we don't want to install updates automatically. We'll do that ourselves, because it takes too long. Just go through all the setup. English United Kingdom, King, yep, all that's done. Right, username, we'll make a local admin account. 
and we'll just call that technician. Helps if it actually types what I put. There we go, technician. I'll leave the password blank for now. We'll add that later. <coughs> I forget, I could use the pen for this as well, because obviously it comes with the stylus. The pros, only the pros come with the stylus. Swipe in from any edge. Closer, seriously. Yeah. It'll go really close. Right, let's swipe in. Whee! Oh, Whee! Oh, oh, it doesn't work. Oh, no. no it's quite deceptive, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it says to do that, but it doesn't yeah. actually want you to. It's like telling you things you can do, but you think you've got to do it. Yeah. It doesn't really let you Move know your mouse into any corner. All right. Oh, it doesn't work. <laughs> I'm joking. Joking, everybody. Don't take it seriously. Don't flame me. No trolling. So stupid. This guy Jake Billing is all crap. <laughs> IT's stuff. rubbish. <laughs> this is what he's doing. He's only been doing it for ten years. Um, yeah, so that's it. There we go. It's all up and running now. So you can see the touch screen is very accurate with the stylus as well. You can see where I click that. You come in really close. You'll see how just how accurate that is. You see how it traces where you are without touching the screen. It's really clever. Very very nice. Pinpoint accuracy. You see how it highlights the icons as well as you hover over them, which is quite cool, so it helps your accuracy there. There's the desktop, and uh, as you can see, it's a very clean looking machine, you know, the resolution's very good, it's, uh, you know, very nice to use, very snappy, very fast, let's bring up Task Manager, so you press and hold with the stylus to bring up the right, you know, the, the option menu, right, right click, and we want points. Helps if I click it right, doesn't it? Change graph to logical processors. So there you go. It's quad core. 1.7 gigahertz, i5. Beast. And they have, like I said, 4 gig of RAM. Uh, they have a 64 gig SSD built in. And obviously Wi Fi. Stuff like that. Nice and fast and snappy. And because it's obviously the the eight, you, uh, the the pro, you can actually install whatever app you want, rather than the eight, the just the eight tablets that we've got, where you can install um, the apps on the app store, so from the, the store. But yeah, it's pretty nice. Uh, right, 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 right. Yeah, the camera's great. So, oh, <laughs> there's the front-facing camera. Hello. Uh, yeah, it has a decent rear one as well. So let's go uh, change camera. Nice. Decent rear facing camera, not bad at all. Swanky, swanky. Julie! Oh, <laughs> oh shit! Shit! I've broken it! Oh, oh, oh. We call this the Surface Sandwich. We have a Surface 2, a Surface Pro, a Surface. <laughs> Pro 2 and a service, <laughs> service, <laughs> a <Yeah>. surface 2. <laughs> okay, shiny, shiny. Me want, me want, me got, me got. <laughs> yeah, overall, good tablets, um, worth a buy.